child's going to be prescribed something that is an opiate and highly addictive, we need to understand that and we need to understand how to take care of that and ensure that our children are safe on the backside of using that medication. We continue tracking the growing opioid epidemic across the nation. Now we've told you about the harmful effects to adults. Well, now new research shows it's impacting people even younger. WNCT's Jessica Joel joins us now in the newsroom to break down these alarming findings. Jessica. This new study was published in the Journal of the American Medical Association's pediatric publication. It looked at the number of hospitalizations for opioid poisonings across the country. Now get this, over the last 16 years, it found a 205% increase in kids ages one to four. Local health experts blame the rise on adults being careless about where they leave medication. While we haven't seen any incidents of toddlers getting into opioids so far in the East, Vidant Chief of Emergency Services, Dr. Ted Delbridge tells me He's not surprised by these findings. The number of prescriptions for opioid medications has increased fourfold over the last 15 years or so. And there have always been accidental overdoses in toddlers and young children. And so it just stands to reason that if you put that much more medication out in the marketplace, uh, that the exposure potentially to children is going to increase also. Dr. Delbridge says they have seen cases of older kids taking prescription opioids with the intent of harming themselves. Any medicine can potentially be toxic to children. That's why it's so important to keep them out of reach in a secure location. Jessica Jewell, 9 on your side.